What, what is it? You, you give me your name. I, I don't need to. Would you give me your name? I don't need to. You don't have my permission to video. You don't have mine either. Oh, Would really? you please remove yourself? Why don't you remove yourself? Why don't you take off oh, those? Look. Shut the oh, please. Who's the loser that Just doesn't leave. know about our rights? I don't rights? want to correspond with you. Just leave. You leave. No, you, you're the one that started. I have some business here. So do I. Well, is your business filming? Filming us as customers? No, but you just made me. Just leave. You're rude. Yeah, you are too. And you don't know that we have the right to be here and film? You can't. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. What's your name? Sir, can you leave? No, you leave. The rules are on the wall, brother. I just read them. Is this guy bothering you guys? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How? By yeah. filming? Yeah. By filming? Yeah. No, I have the right to be here. Look at the rules, bro. Poster seven. Look it up. Okay. It's on the rules. Oh. I'm not speaking to anybody. I'm just filming. Oh. Okay. So if it's if filming is a problem, but you, but you are causing a problem. Now. No, I'm not. I'm just filming. I'm just filming. I'm standing right here on a corner, filming. So don't don't just kick me out. Look at the rules. Look at the rules. They don't have the right. They don't have the. She understands my First Amendment. Oh, call, call, call the police. Call the police. Call the police. Yeah, I have the right to be here. Your rules say it. You're are you, just. Are, are you mailing something out? Huh? Are you mailing something out? I'm working on a story about the post office. Why do I have to discuss my day here with everybody? What the hell? Because you're, you're bothering me. I'm not, I haven't said a word to them, bro. I haven't said a word to them. Why are you accusing me of that? I haven't said a word to anybody, bro. I'm working on a story, man. All right, so let me tell you something. The, no, let me tell you something. Read the rules. Read the rules, Karen. Read the rules, Karen. Read the rules, Karen. Don't tell me nothing. You are. You are. You don't know about our, you don't know about our rights. You don't know about the rules at the post office. All right, so leave me alone. All right, so leave me alone. So from a place of being accountable, you have accountability in what was created here because you... Oh, I have to discuss my day with every person here. You didn't ask permission. I don't have to. I don't have to. If I have freedoms, if you understand our... If I don't understand my freedom, if you understand my freedoms... You are the one that is rude. I haven't said a single word to you, Karen. It's rude I haven't said. No, it's rude to interfere with my job. It's rude to interfere with my job. So you're interfering with everyone here. No, I'm not. I'm just filming. I'm just filming. You are ignorant. I'm ignorant? Yes. What's the Third Amendment? The Third Amendment is that you have the right to film anywhere. You have no, to that's the First Amendment. That's the First Amendment. What's the no, Third Amendment? The Amendment? Freedom of the press is the First Amendment. Freedom of religion and freedom of speech. You're a Karen. No, I'm not. This is a free country. I don't have to tell you anything. I don't have to tell you anything. Yes, you. You're the exact example of a Karen. You are. Disrespectful person. I can't believe it. You are a disrespectful. No, you are. Person. You are. I'm a, I'm more than a respectful person. I'm a good member of society. I don't steal. I don't do bad things. I'm a I photographer. Shut a up. Shut up. That's respectful. No, he that said he used profanity. You are absent he in media release form. Legally, you cannot film. This is a public building. This is a public building. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know I, were, I woke up in you North do Korea. I have a media release form from anybody. I don't need room. to. Want, I don't need one. We have freedom yes, of the press. You need one. Freedom of the press means we all have the freedom to do this. You guys are ignorant. Look up. <laughs> look up. Look up the definition of freedom of the press. What a loser. What a loser. Oh, Can you call the postal police? That's the one you need to call. Because okay. regular police, they don't have jurisdiction here. You, have, okay. you don't even know who to call. Okay. So don't call 911. Right? There's, there's just a camera here. I'm not a threat. Okay. And why is there children back there? Okay. Why is there children back there? That's, not even, that's even against the policy. I don't even going to question that. But um, you're breaking the rules. You're not reading the rules. They're right here. Look, it has a whole section for photographs, bro. I'm not trying to give you a hard time, bro. <laughs> Look, it's right here, bro. Check it out. Oh, you want to be a jerk. Okay. Now, I don't know where you're from, but in Texas, we're polite to each other, man. I've been nothing but polite. He asked you politely to stop filming him, though. I mean, it's just politeness. This is Texas. Bro. What's up, buddy? How's it going, officer? What's going on, man? Um, I'm a citizen journalist. I'm working on a story, on a news story about the post office. 
It's already approved by the postmaster. The supervisor is incorrect. Uh, some customers were upset at the fact that I was filming, but I have already uh, written authorization from the postmaster uh, uh, to you film here. Here. It's right there on the wall. It's in every post office. As long as I'm, as long as I'm not interfering with the business, I can stand on the corner and hey, film. Because uh, the reason we got called out because you're out here yelling at people. So no, they were yelling at me. That's what, that's what we got. Right. Oh no, no, no! I'm not yelling at anybody. They they were yelling at me. Okay, and and just let you know this. Uh, they allowed you to uh, do recording out here. It's yes, it's yes. Property, you know. Uh, th this is federal property, and uh, the rules and regulations uh, from the post office. Uh, clearly state uh, officer that uh, for news purposes video recording is allowed at the uh, and entrances lobbies foyers so, corridors and auditoriums okay, so if people if people get upset that has nothing to do with me you okay, understand i understand why uh, you're here recording but what's the purpose of recording though i'm working on a story about the post office yeah, I'm that i'm upset. that i'm gonna pu that i'm gonna publish about i'm working on uh, uh i'm visiting different post office I, I, honestly i really what don't want to release that. Doing that i'm a citizen journalist and i'm what, I'm what is your reason doing that this is my job <laughs> Job. Yes, sir. Um, this is my job. I would much rather be, you know, downtown walking. What is it? The, well, the you, River you, Center. Then why you do that? Why are you out here doing? Because, this sir. Because the same reason you are. You're, you you got you I'm have to work. Because reason because you cause a but disturbance. You're, That's why I'm out here. Oh no, I didn't cause a disturbance. Okay, they well, did. What, you, know, you have a driver's license. Am I being detained? Yes, sir. No, because the reason I'm called out here for disturbance. That's why. But I'm but that's the thing. It wasn't time, it, it wasn't me. The person that was being this uh, okay, that was creating it. I I'll tell you. What's your name? I'm gonna catch your name though. Hold on, hold on. Give me a second. I'm gonna catch your name. I'd rather not say, but. The thing is, the okay, person that created you know, the person that created the disturbance yeah. left, brother. They left. I, I they just left. Okay. So they were screaming. They were upset. It, it wasn't even the it wasn't even the the clerks. It was the it was the customers. They were upset. They left. They're not here. The complaint. The 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 supervisor called. I tried to show him the rules. He was right there, right next okay, to me. Like, and, and you, they you, have children back okay, there. And you and, 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 and already, haven't you? Huh? You, you did your story already? No. Everybody started interrupting me. Okay. I never bothered anybody, bro at all i didn't speak to anyone and everything is on video and by the way um we have millions of people that have tuned in to um to my uh to my platform so uh this is my daily job brother i'm not here to create a disturbance trust me i didn't come to san antonio for for, for to create a disturbance i came to san antonio to work and and uh and do my be so, my so videos you, you peaceful made, you made your living doing this this is my job sir yeah. okay. this is my job you have, i'm not you have credentials do, uh, I do, I do, but I, I, but I do, but I really don't really have to show them, because, uh, because I, I, I haven't committed a crime. You understand? And and I understand sometimes people. I understand, Mr. Whatever. I don't know what your name is. Okay. So I understand, but people have a problem with it. Okay. And you, they have you, to and respect. You, 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 you got to respect their privacy too. The thing just is, like, just like you were like. But you I never invaded your, anybody's I privacy. That. See, this is a, there's, their, their, their too, but there's not there's not a, there's you not a respect, respect. Right. And I, absolutely, okay. that that's the golden rule. That's the golden rule. I love that. And I learned that from Commander Carrillo uh, from Homeland Security in, in, in Santa Fe, New Mexico. Uh, nice guy. I love that guy. Um, the golden rule is give respect to get respect. That's the, that's the main thing, brother. And, and, and we praise good cops. But the thing is, we run a, uh, we run a, a, a channel that is about uh, accountability. So the same thing you're out there making sure that everybody's doing making that nobody breaks the law and everybody that okay, that well let me speak please sir. Was, uh, so I can explain. Name? What's your good name? What's just your name? Luna. Luna. That's not my name, but you can you can you can read my tattoos. That's okay. fine. Right, but Luna? What, uh, so so I'm not so trying I'm to be just, I'm not trying to be okay, disrespectful. Let's, let's but uh, but I, I haven't broken there. the law. So okay, I haven't. My name is James Ray. I'm with the airport police. Yes, he's wrong. Okay, he has on. no other. He, we need to contact the postmaster because I understand he's a supervisor here, but we're not reading the rules. I have authorization to be here, written authorization from the post from his boss. So we need to contact the postmaster and we need to contact and we need to contact the postal police because you guys have no jurisdiction on private property on, on, unless there's a th an immediate threat. There's not okay, a threat right here. Now. There's okay. just a camera guy. We need to contact the, the, the proper people. Okay. Okay, so sir. you guys, you can't enforce the okay. law here. I'm listening to you. Unless there's a threat. Um, okay. There's no threat. Okay, there, you gotta contact. There, there is a disturbance. That, that, that other people created, sir. No, not sir. me. Yes, the customers did and then they left. Okay. Where this, are this, they? This I said I'd stay here okay. to to speak about it when they when if i have something to hide i would have left i i I'm, have, I'm, I'm just at work I'm, and i'm not and i wasn't disrespect this is your job this is my job sir and i'm trying to explain to him this is my job eight to five i'm a camera guy how you doing sir uh, great thanks
This is my job, <laughs> eight to five. I didn't come to San Antonio to create a disturbance, sir. I, this is my first time here. I'm, I'm a camera guy. I go to post offices all over the country and I'm doing videos about the post office. And like I said, I, I understand that you are, you are the person in charge here. And I, and I understand that you have authorization to tell people to leave when, there, when there's a disturbance, yes. But brother, you didn't see the whole thing. You, you popped up at the end and then you automatically said, you, you need to leave. You need to investigate. You need to make sure that that, that authorization, authorization I have I, I have I have author I have we have author so we we have authorization and I, I, I'm gonna show it to you right now. Hold on, let me turn this off, and I'm not gonna Thank drop you. it on the ground Thank either. You. Um, I'll show you guys. It's right here. Look, no, it's 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 you said you had written authorization it's, from his boss. It is. It's on the wall right here. I can show you. I'm, but I'm, I'd rather not because I'm not being detained. The people that created the disturbance, it wasn't me. Who was it then? It was a lady and she just left. I can give you, I can show you her uh, information. She started yelling at me, bro. I didn't oh, yell. You. You no, 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 there was a misunderstanding. I, I'm here because I want to explain what happened. I'm not, I, I'm at work. I'm not trying to, I never created a disturbance. I never spoke a word, actually, a word. I never said a word. I, and, and, and it was. But I didn't. I, the thing is, he's wrong, brother. Because uh, let me show you the rules. Let me show you the rules. Come here, please, Ria. This and this applies on every post office. Okay. And and like I said, I uh, no dis no disrespect to you or anything, but we need the postal police. Are look, you for that envelope, look, no. look. Okay, so this is the poster seven. Most post offices, they don't know about it, brother. So this is the rules and regulations uh, of conduct on postal property. Okay, so it has a whole section for photographs for news purposes. What I'm doing, just because I, I look like this, like a rapper, and I don't look like the, the average uh, camera guy, doesn't mean that I'm creating a disturbance, bro. Look, so I'll tell you in a minute. So photographs. For news purposes, may be taken in entrances, lobbies, foyers, corridors, or auditoriums when the auditoriums are used for public meetings, except we're prohibited. Okay, so obviously, I can't go back there. Okay, except we're prohibited by official signs. There's not an official sign anywhere here that says that I can't film. Uh, there's actually a sign that says otherwise, uh, unless by prohibited by official signs or security force personnel, which is the uh, their police, postal police, and uh, uh, or a federal court order or rule. Other photographs, such as in uh, restricted areas, may be taken only with permission of local postmaster. So. In the lobby, and look, bro, it's right here. But he doesn't. He doesn't know. Okay, can can you let me talk for a second? Yes. Okay. I understand what you're doing. I understand. And I know I was never okay. disorderly. Okay, give me a second. Yes, sir. What this gentleman told me is that that you were harassing the the customer somehow. He didn't see it. Okay. He came out at the end. That's what I'm I, saying. I, I understand that. And I have everything on uh, video, so if you want to see okay. it. Yeah, I would like to see that. Uh, I want to see the interaction kind of where they were thinking that you were you were being harassed, har harassing the, the customers because, you know, uh, harassing the customers is one thing and uh, that is enforceable because. But they were harassing me. And you let me talk. I understand, sir, but I don't oh, need okay, you to sir, to. So I can't just let you continue uh, uh, accusing me, sir. Okay. With all due respect, I'm not, I, I I'm was not accusing uh, you of anything. Oh, you're saying what they're saying. I understand. You're what, saying what, what they're I'm saying. What I'm trying to do is explain to you. What I'm working on, sir. I am a grown man that well, knows saying, how that I'm, knows how to conduct himself. I'm not talking like, to you like a child. So I no, I, I understand, but I, I I need you I need you, brother, to understand. Yeah, Hold on, excuse, excuse me, excuse, excuse me, brother. Ex ex excuse me, excuse me, brother. I need you to understand that I never I I never um I never did anything wrong here mm -hmm. at all. I was I never used any foul language. Okay. I was never loud. Uh, they were loud. All I was doing was filming. Well, so would, if the complaint is because I didn't, the only complaint was that I didn't ask for permission to film. Everybody, everybody knows that we don't. There's no expectation of privacy in public. I, I am like a paparazzi, and I'm known. Are you a like a paparazzi or are you a paparazzi? Sir, I'm known. I'm known nationwide. Okay, so just okay. just to let you know, I'm I'm, I'm I'm. 
I, I can, know. you guys will find out who, who I am. Even if you tell me to leave right now, if you, if you have a misunderstanding, I just show him the rules. Uh, they're right there. You can uh, explain it to I him. But I never, the thing is, I need you guys to understand that I, I, I was never loud. I never disrespected anybody. Their only complaint is that I was filming and they got upset because people don't understand about our freedom of the press. I'm a citizen journalist. I show, I show, I don't show up with makeup and a, and a, and a, and a suit and a tie, sir. I show, I show up with a snapback and with respect, like, like what we were talking with Lopez. The, the golden rule is respect. You got to give respect to receive. And I am a father of four daughters that I, uh, that I will never do anything on my videos that I am ashamed of. You, you understand? So there was a misunderstanding because the, 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 the gentleman over here, sorry, the gentleman uh, over here arrived at the end. Okay. And he didn't see anything that happened. All he heard was commotion, and it wasn't from me. So the call that we get on our end is, is for disturbance, okay? Yeah. So we got to come over here. We got to figure out. We got to investigate and see what's going on. Mm -hmm. Obviously, you're doing whatever you're doing. You're filming whatever it is that you decide you want to do, right? So now... You're part of investigation now, so now I need to see your ID. But the thing is, you have no authority on, mm -hmm. on federal property because I haven't, I haven't committed no crime. You need to call the postal inspector, and those are the people that are in charge of enforcing any laws here. You, you're on federal property. If we go to, and I mean no disrespect, but if, if our business is on the sidewalk, you talk brother. About being respectful and that's yes, but the respectful. thing, the thing is, I'm, I'm, I'm doing, I'm doing a video, you're sir. I, 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 I am because I haven't said a single bad word. Excuse me. So you're not being respectful. Excuse me. Excuse mentioned. me. That's what you have mentioned. You're listen, being disrespectful. listen, brother. So I have, I have, I have. If, if, if the only complaint is that I'm filming, bro, you can't just, you can't just, yeah, I mean, I, you can't just try to detain me or make my filming uh, suspicious activity or illegal activity. People's actions uh, have nothing to do with me. I was, I was only video recording. I was only video recording. Okay, so, but it's obnoxious, you know? It, it, this is my job. I wasn't, yes. I'm just a camera guy, brother. And the, the rules are on the wall, right here. Let, let, me, let me ask you something. Yes. You said that you're, that you're respectful, which you have been for the most part. Uh, but the people you're filming, did you ask them, hey, you know, out of respect, I'm filming this for this reason, or you just started getting in their face? That's the thing. I, I used to start doing that, but mm -hmm. everywhere I go, People they say, uh, no, right? they say no, that's and right. then I can't. Asking, but the not, thing, so so I so I can't do. But I can't do my job. You don't understand that. But you're not. No, 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 no. Like the right thing now. is, bro. Like okay, no, it's no. the same thing with you. Uh, uh, no, like, you ask you, would you like to be recorded? I do, I do. I'm I'm teaching people that this is our right. The thing is, you're even you're you're even recording us right now. The thing is, Ria, that we have the right to. People's, people's feelings have, have nothing to do with me and their actions. Yeah. If they call the police, people call the police all the time on people. And, and just, does, just because right now it's on a situation that one of uh, your coworkers, pretty much, you know what I'm saying? The, the postal police mm -hmm. works together with you guys, mm -hmm. is calling. Doesn't mean that they could just trespass anybody from here or anything like that for any reason, unless I've broken the law. Like if I was indeed uh, guilty of what? Uh, of what those people thought or what maybe he thinks because he arrived late. Like I said, I have millions and millions and I'm actually more than 100 million people have tuned, uh, have tuned into to my platform. Whether you guys make the decision of kicking me out of here right now or making the good decision of reading the rules, calling the postal inspector, calling the postmaster, making sure first before you make any decision uh, that you're making the correct decision. Uh, because thousands are gonna see it, and I want I want the I want the San Antonio police uh, to 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 look good. I don't want you guys to look bad at all. So. So it's all it's just a matter of uh, mutual mutual respect. Um, I'm not here to bother anybody, but people people can't just start jumping and and most people like uh, going back to the argument that we were talking about. A lot of people I I I, I support the police, but a lot of people don't. A lot of people don't, and you're not gonna stop doing your job because a lot of people don't, bro. A lot of people don't like the police, and and you're not gonna stop doing your job because people don't like it. I'm not gonna stop being a camera guy because people don't like it. I understand some people may feel uncomfortable, and 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 I try to explain to them, look, I'm not here to film you. I'm here to work on a video about the post office. Okay, but, okay. 
With that being said, how is that? How did you approach them? How, why did you contact them? Did you were you filming them? No, I was I was filming the counter, and the and this uh, and this white lady starts, hey, 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 buddy, hey, why are you filming? Acting all Karen-ish, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, ma'am, please, please, I'm not here to film you. I'm here to film the post office. They haven't said a single word. The guys and the clerks in the front were great. I was out there for like three what, minutes what filming. What story are you doing? I mean, you said post office, but what, about what, though? About their service, brother. About their service. Uh, uh, what service is that? How as they, far as the post office? As far as, okay, the post office. Okay, also, okay, so going back to the rules. The rules right there at the bottom, it says no rule in that poster can go against uh, any uh, federal, state, or uh, local uh, laws. So it means... It, it means that uh, uh, that they have to respect that. Also, it, it may sound a little bit uh, a little bit funny, but they have the customer's bill of rights uh, right here at the post office. And just like you guys, the the clerks they take an uh, an oath to protect the Constitution. The same thing, the same oath they take it. And the customer's bill of rights from the post office. I bet you they don't even know it either, but I do because it's my job to audit the post office on their service. I check up, I check up their service and I rate it. I go to, I go to Google, right? And I look up, okay, this post office has a thousand bad reviews and, 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 and like a 1.5 star rating. And I didn't check up on the reviews on this one. I just pulled, I just happened to pull up, but I'm trying, I'm trying to explain to you, uh, what, 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 Oh, he's gonna tell me to leave, yes, and you're gonna and you're gonna trespass me from federal property, even though you have no he's jurisdiction. Trespassing you. I'm not. Even, but, he's trespassing but you have no. You have he, no. He can does. you call the postal police? Yes, sir. But can you please? Can you call the postal police? Leave the property. Please. Can you call the postal police? You have no jurisdiction he's here. You to leave. And if I don't, what's gonna happen? You get arrested. By you on federal property. By me. Under threat of arrest, I'm gonna go ahead and leave. But you guys are tyrants. All right, tyrant, tyrant. You're a tyrant too. I'm gonna go ahead and leave. You guys are a disgrace. I'm gonna sue every single one of you for enforcing laws on, on federal property. You have no jurisdiction here. What you commit, what you just did right now is a crime. You just committed a crime. I need your name and batch number. Everybody's name and batch number before I leave. What's your name and batch number? 9961, What? Medellas 9961. And you? What, what is it? You see right there. What's your name? You see right there. I ain't gonna tell you. You ain't tell me your name. What's your name? Yes, you do. You're an employee. What's your name? You, know, you, you give me your name. I, I don't need to. I'm leaving. Would you give me your name? I don't need to. I'm gonna find out everything about you guys, and I'm gonna expose you guys for the tyrants that you are. All right? You have no authority to do this on federal property. Your city police. Call the, call the supervisor. Call the sergeant. Your, sar your sergeant. I think the supervisor is here now. Yes, it is. Thank you so, thank you so much for taking your time uh, coming over here to deal with this situation. Uh, what's your name? Sergeant Joe Ledesma. I'm Enrique. Nice to meet you. I refuse Morales. to get... Morales. Morales. Yeah. How you doing, sir? How do you know my name? I know who you are. But I've never met you. I've seen you on YouTube. Okay, YouTube awesome, stuff. awesome. So, so if you've seen my videos, you know I'm a nice guy. Yeah. I don't go out. Uh, I don't go out disrespecting people right. Uh, right. or breaking the law right. because I would not put my my je my my freedom in jeopardy. Sure. Although I'm exercising dangerous freedoms, and also my children are watching my videos, so I would never right. I would never uh, upload anything that I'm ashamed of, ashamed of. Um, we're over here at the uh, at the post office. Right. We uh, we do hundreds of videos at the post office for years, for years and years and years, bro. I, I, I've, I've I've lost my hair doing this. You know what I'm saying? Um, yes, some somebody was being disorderly. It wasn't me. Okay. okay. They left. Okay. It was a lady. She was screaming. She was creating a drama because I was right. filming. Okay. And okay. then and then the supervisor had no clue about anything that happened and arrives and he's like, sir, I need you to leave. I need, I'm, I'm like, hold on, wait, 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 hold your horse, hold your horses, tiger. I didn't do anything. I was just working on my story filming. Sure. So you know how I do my thing, bro. I show up and I just film. I'm not disrespectful at all. Okay. And, and you know, Sergeant, that your, your officers can't make threat of arrest anybody in right. federal property unless there's an immediate threat. There's not a threat. There was a, there was a, a simple investigation of a, 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 of, a, of a simple disturbance, bro. Right. And the, the correct people to, to deal with any law enforcing in this building 
It's the postal police. It's not you guys. So I explained to him, not only that, I showed him the rules. The rules are on the wall. The supervisor is a young guy. The poster the, seven you're talking about? Yes. The, 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 I, I'm so glad that you know about these videos. The supervisor is a young guy. He could be my kid. And, and he just doesn't know. And just like everywhere we go, he doesn't know. I'm, I'm, I'm glad I, I don't have to fully explain to you this shit because you, you understand the concept. What do you want from us? Sir? So I, 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 I want to get back in there because he has no, oh, first of all, I didn't break the law. Okay. So if I, if, if indeed I, it was just- so the, I, other, the other person's gone, the one you talk about? They left. I told her, y'all don't go. It was a lady? Yeah. Operating. Yeah, she took off. She was like a, a Karen and she was a Karen, bro. You've yeah. seen those videos. And I told these officers, look, man, whether you tell me to leave or whether you do the right thing and call the, call the postal inspector or read the rules, bro, it's the First Amendment. This is simple stuff. I'm going to leave, but this is going to make you guys look bad. I, I, I stand right here and I said, now you call the supervisor because now the tables have turned, I told him. Right. Now now, uh, uh, now we have the, the, the right person. And I tell you, bro, I've, I've done a few videos on, uh, on the past few days and I've had some epic fails, but... Here in San Antonio, uh, but so, shout out to Sergeant Martinez. Mm -hmm. I don't know if from the same uh, female uh, officer from the. I don't know if from the same. No, you're airport police. But she showed up and saved me some, from also from some tyrant cops, and that's gonna be that's gonna be exposed because we promote good cops. We love good cops. So I just want to go back in there, bro. Uh, let our viewers know that you know the, the the supervisor has no authority to trespass me because I didn't break any laws. Uh, it's Let me all. Go talk to them. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna say that I was screaming. He doesn't know. He wasn't there. I have it all on video, so you can't just okay. really take anything that he can, said. Can we see the video? Is there a way we can do it? I can, but I'd have to turn off my camera, and I really don't want to do that. But I, I, but you guys will see the video. You know what I'm saying? Okay. We'll go, we'll go talk to them. We'll all right. Back. All right. Can you just stand by right here. Okay? No problem. We'll be, we'll be back. They know who I am. Yo. They recognized me through the fucking mask. Yo, so you're saying I could come back? Yes. What am I supposed hey. to say? If he I said, just wait a second. He's going to go check. Hey, they're not, they're not going to let you go. Come talk. Come talk. We may go back. We may go back. Don't tell me we may. Don't tell me I'm about to do my victory lap and go, and go home happy. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on that. Oh. Oh, well, I'm just gonna. Uh, I, I, when I say victory lap, you know what? You know what I mean? I mean I peacefully walk back in there and I show our viewers that 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 you know the San Antonio Police Department ended up doing the right thing, and that uh, yes, we can come. Uh, there, yes, there can be disagreements, uh -huh. but we can come together uh, to an understanding if we all listen to each other correctly. Uh, uh, that officer was incorrect. The, the sergeant looks uh, looks like he knows uh, about uh, about me already and the type of videos that I do. So he should already know that I'm a nice guy uh, because I don't ever uh, I don't ever do anything I'm ashamed of. So hopefully we can go back in there, show our viewers that that we we still got freedom over here at the United States Post Office Airport Mail Facility in San Antonio, Texas. And that I don't ever have to come back here again because I probably never will. And this and is a boring post office. And, and <laughs> yes, the, yes, uh, they went postal real quick too. And 
Some people would, would disagree with you, Ray. They'll say this is an entertaining post office because look what just happened. But, <laughs> but I'm, I'm most likely never ever coming back here again. And, 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 and I'm 100% sure that if this investigation goes uh, the way that it's looking right now, the supervisor will never, ever, 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 ever call the police again on somebody without making a proper investigation, especially for taking a video in a public place. So we have the sergeant coming over here right now. All right. Sergeant, what, what's going on? Oh, guys. Guys. Guys, we have freedom here. That's why this guy's a sergeant. I got freedom, I'm back. Mr. Morales. Yes, sir. Hey, you're good to go, man. Um, we talked to them inside, we explained to them what you guys are doing out here. They don't have an issue with it. Of course, obviously, you know, as long as you don't bother customers and all that good stuff, you're good to go. So, right. do you need anything else from us? I need, I, I need a handshake. There Thank you, you so much. Thank you so much. Corporal Delgado, 9920. Corporal Delgado, guys, I want everybody to go uh, uh, give a good, a good complaint. A good, oh, good complaint. A good complaint. <laughs> On, on Corporal Delgado, and this is Sergeant, Sergeant Ledesma. Ledesma. Sergeant Ledesma just, and Corporal Delgado just saved me from from the lies of the post office, just saved me from tyrant cops. I'm sure, I'm not gonna file complaints on those guys, but I'm sure that you guys will, will have a word with Fire them. Sure. Um, this guy's a good cop. He just really, he, oh man, he was in a tight spot. He had two bad cops. And then, and, and then him, and I, I could tell that he wanted to do the right thing. Sure. But, but he ended up feeling under pressure. But, man, you got some good fucking le leadership. leadership. Right, nice, see, nice meeting you. Thank you. Nice, nice meeting you. Nice meeting you, sir. How'd you know about, how'd you know my name? You're big on YouTube. You're a cop. <laughs> You're all over YouTube. Oh, yeah. uh, hey, but thank you, thank you. Yeah, what I'm saying, hey, we're famous if you send the Fernandez, man. Vicente Fernandez, no, I doubt that. <laughs> Shout out to Vicente Fernandez. Much love to those people. They, his whole family's famous. G right, guys, so you guys have a good day, okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ray, Ray is a good guy. Ray is a good guy. Uh, don't, don't, don't chill with those guys. <laughs> Later, guys. We're gonna do our victory lap. Oh yeah, guys. That's why Mr. America does what he does. We're gonna go back in there. Freedom is still here at the post office. Hey, I, I'm leaving right now, but I wanted to give uh, good credit to you and, and to the other gentleman over here. I didn't see him. You, I wanted to give credit to you, sir, uh, for, for not being bothered at all about my video when I was filming. It was only those people who were uh, disrespectful. Uh, I nearly got arrested. Supervisors came over, explained that we have the right to be here. Um, sir, you have a good day. You have a good day. This is what we call the victory lap. Victory lap. Guys, we'll see you on the next one. Peace.